Hello and welcome. In this video, we're going to be looking at how to differentiate the inverse tan of x. So we're going to be using some implicit differentiation, and this is a topic that you need to know for the A-level maths course in year 13. Now let's go through what you should already know at this point. So you should already know that sine squared plus cos squared is equal to 1. Now if we divide this through by cos squared, like this, we will end up with tan squared plus 1, is equal to 1 over cos squared, which is sec squared. Okay, and we also need to know how to differentiate implicitly. So I'm just going to highlight this result because we're going to need to use that in a few slides. So how do we differentiate inverse tan, also known as arc tan of x? So let's start off by letting y equal the inverse tan of x. And if we take tan of both sides, we end up with tan y equals x. From here, we can differentiate implicitly. Now, the differential of tan is sec squared. So when we differentiate tan y, we get sec squared y, but divide by dx. And then the differential of x is just 1. We can then rearrange this to get dy by dx is 1 over sec squared y. So let's highlight this result and this result. And we're going to put all of this together now. So how do we differentiate? So we know that tan y is equal to x. Now if we square that, we just get tan squared y is equal to x squared. We also know that dy by dx is equal to 1 over sec squared y. And we know this result here, that tan squared y plus 1 is equal to sec squared y. So let's start off with the green result. dy by dx is equal to 1 over sec squared y. But what do we know about sec squared y? Well, over here in the yellow box, sec squared y is equal to tan squared y plus 1, which is the same as 1 plus tan squared, so 1 over 1 plus tan squared y. Now, what do we know about tan squared y? Over here in the blue box, tan squared y is equal to x squared. So we can change that into 1 over 1 plus x squared. So the differential of the inverse tan of x is 1 over 1 plus x squared. So if y is equal to the inverse tan of x, then dy by dx is equal to 1 over 1 plus x squared. And that's your final answer. We hope you found this video useful. If you did, please hit the like button as it really helps more people like you find this video. If you haven't already subscribed, hit the subscribe button and click on the bell to be notified of our next video. See you next time. Bye.